Welcome to Midland, Texas, a city with a rich history and a bright future. Located in the heart of the Permian Basin, Midland is known for its oil and gas industry and is home to many thriving businesses and organizations. But is Midland the right place for you to call home? Hi, I'm Allie Moore, a realtor here in Midland, Texas. And in this video, we're gonna cover some of the pros and cons of what it's like to live here in Midland. We'll cover everything from cost of living to the job market, even schools and community. So let's dive in and see all that Midland has to offer. Midland is the center of the Permian Basin, which is home to a plethora of oil and gas companies, but there are also other industries such as healthcare and education. Pro, we are far below the national average when it comes to unemployment rates pretty consistently. Con, we're also higher than the national average when it comes to cost of living, which can certainly be a drawback to living here. While we're on the topic of cost of living, it's important to note a pro for Texas is that we don't collect state income tax. Con, our property taxes are significantly higher. Now let's talk a little bit about the community and lifestyle here in Midland, Texas. With a population of about 138,000, we're a medium-sized city with a great combination of rural and suburban living. The average commute time is only about 18 minutes, making it a great place to live and work. We have a plethora of activities and amenities, such as parks, shopping centers, and cultural events. We have so many awesome parks and outdoor venues. Midland is home to the Bush Tennis Center, the Rock Hounds baseball team, four golf courses, a polo club, and of course, the high school football teams made famous by Friday Night Lights. If you've seen the movie or the show, it's a pretty good representation of how seriously Midlanders take high school football. Pro, the weather. As you can tell, we have so much available for outdoor entertainment, and that's largely due to our relatively mild climate. Con, the weather. While it is nice the majority of the time, when the weather acts up, it can be pretty harsh. We can be plagued with droughts, but then when it does rain, the roads flood and are pretty hard to travel. And of course, we have dust storms, and let's just say they are not fun. It also can get extremely hot in the summer, but don't worry, it's a dry heat. Pro, we have some amazing food and beverage establishments. The recently revitalized downtown area has a mixture of tried and true restaurants that have been serving Midland for years as well as new trendy spots that are delicious and give that big city vibe. We have some of the best Tex-Mex ever, loads of barbecue that is top notch and everything else you can imagine. Yes, we even have great seafood spots in the middle of the desert. Many local restaurants often fly in fresh seafood. Con, customer service is in our strong suit. Don't get me wrong, there are plenty of amazing servers, hostesses, and whatnot, but it is no secret that the hospitality industry struggles to keep employees. This is simply because employees often leave to go to higher paying oil field jobs. If you are coming from a larger city, be prepared for a little longer dining experience and of course, be patient with those who are serving you. They do their best, but it's a tough industry. Pro, we have an international airport that runs on average 159 flights per day. That means it's fairly easy to fly to your destination right from Midland with direct flights to Vegas, Dallas, Houston, and Denver to name a few. Con, traveling from Midland is gonna just take you longer. A local brewery here even named a beer five hour drive. We all joke that everything is at least five hours away by car. Five hours to Dallas, five hours to San Antonio, five hours to Austin. So be prepared if you're used to being able to vacation places with just a short drive because it's not as easy to get to. When you move to Midland, it can often feel really isolating and lonely. But I always encourage people to get involved in their community and do their best to get out of their comfort zone and make that connection. So whether you're going to a mom group or a church or even just a park play date, reach out to that person because I almost guarantee you someone else is in the same boat looking for that friend. Pro, the people. Ask any native Midlander or anyone who's been here any length of time their favorite thing about this town, and nine times out of 10, they're gonna tell you the people. And it's true, Midlanders are some of the most generous people you'll ever meet. The trick is finding your people, and I almost guarantee if you do, you'll love this town too. In conclusion, Midland, Texas has a lot to offer, whether you're looking for a job in the oil and gas industry or a convenient and active lifestyle. However, the higher cost of living and the reliance on the oil and gas industry can be seen as a drawback to some. I hope this video helped you weigh the pros and the cons of living here in Midland. Sure, Midland isn't perfect and it's not for everybody, but I do love it here and I think it's a great place to raise a family. If you decide to make Midland your home, 
I hope this video helped you just a little bit. And if you need more information or would like my relocation guide, please reach out and send me a message and I'd be happy to help you. Thanks for watching.